our first guest. You've heard his song, Fly, from the group Sugar Ray. Please welcome guitarist Rodney Shepard. So, Rodney, how you doing? Go ahead and put on this mic right here. And how you doing, man? It is. Good to be here, We're hearing the song Fly right now. That's from your first album, or second album, second Ford. Album, yeah. And uh, you guys recorded this album in like a crack house. Is that right? What yeah. is this? No, we didn't record it. We actually went to New York uh, just to get away from all our distractions so we could sort of be by ourselves. Because you're all from Los Angeles. Yeah, we're Los Angeles from area. Beach. Okay. So we all went to high Orange school. County! Yeah. 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 We, uh, we rented out just this old rehearsal place. It was real rundown, sort of like a, it looked like it was a crack house, you know, right in the heart of, of uh, Manhattan. And we wrote all the songs there, and then we came back here and recorded it in Los Angeles. Uh, the, so. the video is incredibly funny. It's fun to make. Yeah, your dog's in that video oh, and yeah. fly? Austin the Bulldog, yep. And, and uh, how long have you had him? Uh, he's, he's four, he's five years old now. So did you, did, was he in the pool with you? You guys have seen the video for, for Fly, where they're all in the pool. How was that working in a, in a pool? How long did it take you? Uh, it, was, it was an afternoon, and uh, I'm not a real good swimmer, so it was, it was sort of a challenge for me to stay. They put big weights in our pants so that we could stay underwater. Oh, yeah. Uh, that, was, that was actually my, my least favorite part of the video. <laughs> did the dog get in the pool with you? Uh, no, bulldogs can't really swim, so we have to get a, <laughs> they, they were head heavy, so they sink, so we have to get a, a water weenie to hold them up. <laughs> in a little yeah. ring. That's nice. Yeah. Join the dog uh, paddle. All right, so you were uh, you were a telemarketer. Yes. Uh, all throughout. Was this to get you through high school and college? Um, it was just sort of a, to get me through until the band kind of did what it's done now. And uh, I just sold, you know, swamp land in Florida and stuff like that. It was a real shady thing. But it got me through. So, uh -huh. yeah. And did you also make dentures? Yep. I went to a dental technology school and I made dentures. And uh, that really got me down, so I got the hell out of there. <laughs> Well, uh, how did you get interested in, in guitar? How long have you been playing? Um, I've been playing since I was in junior high. So uh, I started, you know, about seventh grade. And I'm um, interested just because I, I really loved music. I loved the Beatles and stuff. And uh, I always wanted to be like them. So. And it was also a, uh, an easy A. It was an easy class. It was an elective, you know, guitar. <laughs> Love those electives. Love those so electives. Who knew it would turn out to be so good for me, though? That's great. Yeah. Well, y your big mentors kiss. Yes. Why aren't you wearing the makeup dear, in the band? Oh, that's for them. Uh, we did get the honor of opening a show for Kiss in Seattle once, and it was it was a great time. It was like it was my first concert I'd ever been to when I was in uh, sixth grade many many years ago, and to actually come around and, and get to be on the same stage as them was like, you know, beyond a dream come true. Is Gene Simmons' tongue really as long as? It's it? really long, and he's he's really a big guy, and he's really a nice guy too. He was really cordial to us. So You've opened funny. up for bands like Corn also. Yeah, that was our very first tour that the band went on. Um, for our first record, Corn took us out, and uh, we were, you know, we were real fresh and, and new to the road, and they kind of broke us in, and it was a good time. It got us, got us started. Now, Rodney, you're newly married. Congratulations yes, on that. Thank you. I was lucky enough to get to get the girl that just won my heart, and uh, she's been a real supporter of the band for ten years. We've been wow, doing that's so. great. Now, since uh, you've gotten this fame. What are the fans like? How does she handle the, the women throwing themselves at? Oh, I don't get women throwing myself. You're, you're getting me confused with Mark, our singer. Oh, well, well, hey, that. but the whole band, you know? The, the, each, uh, each person usually goes, well, I want the guitar player, I want I the drummer, I want She's uh, real happy for me. I mean, you know, I, I try to just handle it with a cool head and, you know, enjoy it while I can. Any, any weird things that have ever happened to you on stage? Um, we get all sorts of weird stuff thrown up on stage, like, you know, like bras and underwear and... and Stuff like that, but I don't know. The weird stuff that's happened to me is I, I trip a lot over my own feet. So I've, oh, I've I was going to say twelve-step program. Not going to be all right. <laughs> I've fallen off the stage oh, a few okay. times and stuff like that. Well, yeah. we'll be back right with you. Can you stick around? Absolutely. All right, Rodney Shepard is here, and we'll be back with Kobe Stefani and her reptiles coming up in minutes. <laughs> Janie. Janie, your date's here. We'll be back early. Tomorrow morning. <laughs> we'll be back by midnight. Yeah, as long as you want. Okay.
that, I can't believe you let her go out with Mickey the Makeout King. Don't worry, son. I placed the Guardian in her purse. A what? The Guardian. coming out soon, Sugar Ray the yes, Group. What's the title? It's called 1459, and uh, it's a little play on Andy Warhol's 15 Minutes of Fame. Oh, wow. Had a second. Yeah. Hey, you've gotten to work with some great people. In fact, uh, a big shot at fame was with working with two of the best comedic, comedic greats, Billy Crystal and Robin Williams in the movie Father's yes. Day. That was another dream come true. We just sort of like, we're in the right place at the right time, and uh, we got to be in that movie, and those guys are every bit as funny as you think they are, especially Robin Williams. He ne he's, he's crazier when they say cut off camera than he is on, if you can imagine that. And Billy Crystal's very kind of quiet and reserved, but everything he says is hysterical, you know. Now, this Classic. was for a movie, so you had like 15,000 people in this auditorium yeah. jumping up and down. How did they control all of that and make it a movie like, set? They had like, you know, the, a head punk guy that had like, you know, studs in his mouth and everything. He directed the whole slam pit. You and, can see uh, it right there. Yeah, there, that, that guy right there, the guy with the white hair. Yeah, oh, really? He's actually the boss of the whole thing. Well, and congratulations yeah. on your platinum albums. We oh, just saw that in your gold you albums. Much. Incredible. Uh, now, you're looking for Fly uh, just uh, after this uh, to, to be more successful than the song Fly. Well, those right? are some big shoes to fill. We're, yeah. we're just hoping to like just get another chance to get a song on the radio and get out and tour again and you know see the world some more. So I mean, we're not really expecting anything but just to keep going like we're doing. Hey, so. Now, where have you toured uh, across seas at all? Uh, we've, we've toured in Japan, all over Europe, including like places like Finland that, that you pretty much only want to go there once or twice. Why? What's wrong with Finland? Oh, it's just a real strange place. You know, anywhere with moose crossing signs all over. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, we've got to go to you know, all over the United States uh, many, many times and we're looking to go to Australia probably in January. Well, congratulations um, to you and the band. Right. The band is Sugar Ray. The song, or the uh, album is 1459. 49, yes. Available in stores when? Uh, it'll be uh, January 12th is when it comes out. All right, just a post-Christmas gift for you. We yes. will be right back with Kobe Stefani from Reptropolis, so stay with us.